How to change your battery in SteelSeries Arctis 7 gaming headsets. Here I have an Arctis 7 SteelSeries gaming headset and I have some replacement ear pads on here. Actually these are extra large deep set ear pads. Uh, we sell these at Central Sound. We have cooling gel ones, velour ones, and different materials. So first thing you would do is remove that on the right side, the right ear cup, remove the ear pad. And then you would set that aside and you would need a small Phillips screwdriver just like this one here. There's three screws that are holding the speaker housing to the ear cup. You want to remove those three screws. Set those aside, don't lose them. Once all the screws are removed, be careful when pulling up on the speaker housing. There are wires connected. You do not want to separate or disconnect them. You would need a soldering iron to disconnect the red, white, and black wire from the board. Then you pry up on the battery. From underneath, there is adhesive holding it to the headset. So you just want to pry up so it becomes loose. And once it is loose, you do not want to uh, touch the red wires and black wires together. Uh, keep those wires separated. So here's the original stock battery. It is 1100 milliamp hours, which is uh, slightly smaller than our battery. Uh, we have our central sound battery here, which is a 1300 milliamp hours. So you'll get a longer use per charge. And you want to also make sure not to touch the black and red wires together uh, while you are installing the battery and afterwards as well. So I got some T8000 to use as adhesive. Put a little bit on the back and place it in the same spot the original battery was in. Push on it. Usually it dries fairly quickly. So you can let it set for maybe 10 minutes. And then you are ready to solder the wires to the board. So I would start off with the red wire first. And that is the positive. So you need a soldering iron to do this. If you do not have a soldering iron, you can pick one up for fairly cheap. You can get a cheap one for maybe $10, $15. Uh, always make sure to tin your soldering iron. That means add a little solder to the tip of it. As you can see here, it's a different color. And uh, you just want to make sure you do that before you solder. You can order a battery directly from us in the description. And I'll also have a link pinned in the comment section. Uh, if you found this video helpful, please like and consider subscribing. We do pump out uh, content related to gaming headsets and headphones. So we got several different parts for gaming headsets and headphones as well. Once all the wires are soldered in securely, you can put the speaker housing back on the headset. So you just want to move it and adjust it until it lines up and it's flush. Then you could go ahead and install those screws back in. And once these screws are installed, you can uh, install the ear pad back on, which uh, these goes up, go on pretty easily. Once again, these are our Central Sound premium upgraded ear pads. We have cooling gel ones, velour ones. You can purchase them in the description. There will be a link as well as a battery um, if you need it. And here I have a charger cable. I'm just going to plug that in just to make sure that it's charging appropriately before. Yep, there it is. So there's the red light. Uh, we do have power going through the unit. Everything is working properly. So 